All right, guys, what's going on? We're out here uh, at an office park this morning trying to get it uh, knocked out. Got a couple other office parks to do today. Uh, not a whole lot of mowing going on today, but we are going to kind of service the equipment and do that kind of stuff. And uh, it is Sunday morning, and like you guys know, I don't like to mow on Sundays, but it's kind of becoming a, I wouldn't say a must, but uh, a lot easier because mowing these office parks on a Sunday is just way, way easier than it is mowing them during the week. So it's not, it's not that big a deal to come out here on a Sunday morning, uh, a few hours, and just knock them out real quick and be done with it. And I'll kind of show you kind of why it's a little bit easier. You got these islands here. We got these islands. And as you can see, we mowed this one on Monday last week. We didn't work on Easter Sunday. But that's where a car was parked up over. See, and that's where a car was kind of parked up onto the, uh, you know, it was kind of overhanging there a little bit. And you just, you can't get to it. And then they leave and it looks like crap. And it's just way easier. I don't like my stuff looking like that. Um, it's either that or we're gonna work six seven o'clock at night trying to get these done and You know, it's just easier. Uh, I, I don't know what else to say. It's just easier So we're not gonna do it every Sunday, but uh, the majority I'd probably say about half the Sundays. We're gonna try to knock these out um, In the morning, so I know you guys have seen this property a lot so I'm not sure what I'm gonna record but I need to get started So we're done mowing for the day right now we're, me and Jesse we're gonna head back to the shop we're gonna try to get everything uh, maintenanced up for uh, for this week blade sharpened uh, mowers clean deck scraped uh, things like that uh, I want to get the shop kind of cleaned up um, but the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna load up all my grass uh, I got this truck full of grass we got the other trailer it's got grass on it so I'm gonna hook up to that trailer we're going to go to uh, where I dumped my grass at. We're going to get rid of that. Jesse's going to start cleaning the stuff up. So uh, try to get everything ready and, and uh, maintenance stuff for tomorrow and the rest of the week. So, uh, so that's what we got going on today. All right, so I get the question all the time, what trimmer line do I like the best? And honestly, I never really respond because I don't know how to spell Husqvarna. <laughs> but this is the trimmer line that I love the best. Uh, I've used most uh, most trimmer lines. This is what I found works best for me. 
uh, it tends to last a little bit longer. Um, I just I just like the line, so that's what I continue to use. So it's the Husqvarna Titanium Force. Uh, I use the 095, and uh, works out really good. All right, so I ended up getting, like I said, the trimmer line. Uh, I needed a couple of uh, putty knives for scraping decks. And then uh, I ended up getting a couple small little toolboxes to go in the big toolbox. Because I have a I have a socket set, a tool set that goes in there. But, you know, with those sets, every time you open them, the, the sockets don't stay in place. They, they fall everywhere. The tools come out and all that. So I just bought a couple small little toolboxes. I'm going to put all that stuff in there, get rid of the uh, tool set box, whatever, and uh, just go with it that way because I'm tired of just having stuff opening or falling out whenever you open it and not closing all the way because things are falling out and all that kind of stuff. You guys know what I'm talking about. So I'm going to throw that one away, put the stuff in the new ones, and call it a day. All right, so I got all my grass ready to go, ready to go to the dump. Jesse's uh, cleaning. But this is all the grass we picked up this week. That was left in the hopper. That's some nasty stuff right there, boy. And we got this full, so. So yeah, we got a lot of grass to go dump, but we're gonna do that. We're gonna get some, uh, get some lunch, come back and finish up cleaning up the mowers. All right, got that done. That sucked. And I know what you guys are thinking. When are you gonna get a dump bed or a dump trailer or something? Here's the thing. I really want one, uh, but you know, I want to keep my overhead the way it is. I don't want to buy anything right now. Um, definitely don't want to take out another loan. Um, and I could go buy the dump trailer or a dump bed right now, but I just don't want to spend that spend that that money right right now so that's kind of where I'm at on that uh, you know you know when you're running a business or at least you know the way I think of it uh, running my business uh, you know obviously there's a lot of things that I need that would make my life a lot easier a lot of things that I could use and you know you can't just go out and buy everything all at once so you know kind of what I've done is try to buy the necessities, uh, things that are going to make my my uh, my job a lot easier, faster, more efficient as far as mowing goes. Um, obviously, a dump truck or something like that is in the near future, I think, but just not right yet. So we're just going to have to shovel and rake for a little bit while longer until I'm ready to buy one. All right. So as you guys can see, we're doing a little maintenance today. I uh, brought the boys up here, uh, they're, they're helping out, Tyson's getting everything kind of sprayed and cleaned up, and uh, we're, doing, we're doing a good job. <laughs> 